Shoot, y'all thought this was a game? Look at that. Almost like the real deal. You can even leave one original wheel on for a wheelie bar wheel. Let's try this lug out. Oh, yeah. oh. You can't stop me now. Hello everybody, Jamie the Cleaner here. Welcome to the channel. We are in the garage today checking out our work chair solution package. We'll start over here with the Lowe's Pro Spider uh, work stool. It's a pretty cool, you know, bar stool type of chair that you see in like auto parts stores and pretty cool chair. You can find these at Lowe's on a Black Friday. That's where I picked up this one. But the workhorse chair of the garage for the last few years has been the Pittsburgh Mechanics Roller Seat, as many of us have in our garage. But you can see, as by the intro video, that I upgraded it with some Harbor Freight 4-inch casters. You can also find uh, the nut washer and bolt assortment pack at the Harbor Freight. So you can upgrade everything you need for the Harbor Freight Seat Upgrade Package at Harbor Freight from the nuts, the bolts, the chair, and the four inch casters. Now, as you saw how that worked out, I took off my little wheelie bar. That was more for comic relief. We only had four casters on at the time. You can see we have all five now changed over to the four inch casters. So there's a DIY solution package for a better roller, for a better mechanics rolling seat. But it was time to call in the big boys over at Viper Chair. As you can see, I haven't even opened the package. So that's what this video is gonna be about. We're gonna put this thing together and we're gonna test it out. We're gonna see if the Viper Chair is the real deal or is it all hype? And can you get away with just the DIY Harbor Freight solution package? We'll see, we'll compare them both. The big factor is going to be the quality and the parts of this one where I'm sure these casters will wear down at a pretty aggressive rate, just like the original ones did. But we'll see. Let's get this thing together. This is going to be in fast forward. I'm a terrible uh, putter together type of person, but if you like adult Legos, Viper Chair, got you covered with that as well as full assembly is required of their high quality work chair. So let's check it out. This is also the Robust Steel Pro version, their newest model. It is the workhorse of the Viper chair family. Let's get this thing together so we can check it out. So my brother-in-law produced this shit, right? Rock with me. First take. 
Yeah. A young truth seeker in pursuit of deeper definition Study line for line to be abided by the kind of guidance written in the wisdoms Always taught the conflict as we all forgotten in the sin until we get forgiven In a time we find an even jaw disciples got an itch for living a little wicked When it came down to climbing, I got lifted Saw the man of God was turning about face with a pretty black girl Who was singing high praise on the same stage He would minister about faith Can we talk about stakes? To them led astray and inspired to the wrong I was led to the pyre but I stepped out fine Now everybody recognizing it's a fire in his bones I was wired to the throne So it sound like that from the south so it bounced like that When you do the elevation the haters precipitating bad weather I don't even come around like that I'm overcoming a hundred to none They say it's nothing new under the sun Ten years of rep in the class of eleven Cause even back then I was one of them ones So there we go the robust steel pro fully assembled Assembly is pretty straightforward. Don't tighten everything up until you get the seat on and then tighten everything up. Comes together just like that. You can see casters are so good that it kind of takes off by itself. And it's still going. That's how easy those casters roll. But the real test is going to be my raggedy driveway. As you can see, it's already making its way that way. Okay, let's test it out on the driveway. First, we'll do the DIY Viper. DIY Harbor Freight Chair. It's actually probably it's a little better than I expected it to. A little better than, especially a lot better than when it had the wheelie bar on it. It's still pretty rough ride. On the raggedy driveway. But still, DIY version. A lot better than the regular version. The regular Harbor Freight chair does not scoot at all on my driveway. All right, now let's try out the Viper chair. Oh man, it is so comfy. This is the first time I've sat on one and it is quite comfortable. So smooth, oh my goodness. This is nice. All right, this is a nice chair. I mean, it really feels like you're floating a little bit. All right, let's try it on the driveway. Oh, it did slow down a bit. You can still hear the noise, pretty noisy. Very comfortable, you can still, you can still brush the bottom of the wheel. The tire, getting them fender wells. As you can see, the tell you ride is very dirty. skates skates around very well wow i'm a little more impressed with this chair than i thought it was going to be as you can see the storage comparison not even close i mean just a lot of stuff let's see if we can fit that case sprayer we got the wheels so yep can even put your IK sprayers there with no problem but just see it skates so easy it can kind of get away from you so you're gonna have to watch that you don't want this bumping into any cars or anything We've got everything powder coated tray powder coated legs a super plush nice seat 
when you sit in this, it's it's different. It's nice. You see, you can make it kind of fit on the DIY version, but not really. Oh man, it's hot. There you go. The DIY Harbor Freight four inch, with the four inch casters is a lot nicer though than the stock and then the bone stock Pittsburgh mechanics chair definitely recommend if you're going cheap DIY way upgrade those casters you can even drill you measure it out and drill an extra hole to secure those casters a little better you see they have four holes I just was doing it mostly for the joke but it actually turned out a lot better than I thought it was so that's actually a pretty nifty DIY thing to do but I went ahead Bought me a Viper. See all my Instagram and YouTube friends getting one. They sold me on it, and I think it's going to work out very nice, especially all the tire coatings, wheel coatings I got coming up. Coating lower panels. Oh, man, it's very nice. You see, this one is not adjustable. It is just all bolted in. Once you get it assembled, it is just all together in one solid state but you can still see it's still taller so you can see this is the hard freight chair at full height almost the same height as the viper a little bit taller but that pneumatic thing you know goes out pretty quickly but i've had this hard freight chair for probably two years now and it's still working pretty good been a good chair, Harbor Freight. You just went up to went up to the task. Now you're a little better. There you go. Whether you go DIY Harbor Freight or you go full in with the Viper chair, I think both are definitely going to get the job done. Both are great choices. You know, the real test will be time with the Viper chair as it. We'll see how long it does outlast the Harbor Freights. You can see these casters. You can just touch them. You touch everything about the Viper chair and then touch the Harbor Freight chair and you just know there's a little more quality, higher made products. Whew. Hopefully one day pass this down to my son and he'll have him a Viper chair in his garage. So next step, I'm probably bead maker, all the powder coating, put some color lock sealant after I clean the top now. After assembling it all, I'll sweat it all over this thing, so it needs to be cleaned now and sealed with color lock leather sealant. And that's all I got. And this was just a fun little video of me unboxing, putting together my Viper chair. It's a whole lot cooler to film, a little video about the Viper chair. And it is anything in the driveway as of late. It is just nuclear out here. But all right, that's all I got. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Viper chair, shout out to Viper chair, shout out to Lex Garage. I think I'm going to very much enjoy the Viper chair. It won't stop rolling. That's all I got. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Catch you in the driveway on the next one. Good stuff. Like, subscribe. Jamie Cleaner out. It's hot. Under the sun, 10 years of rep in the class of 11, cause even back then I was one of them ones.